Not gonna lie, after watching this movie, I wanted to go out and get some Formula One racing games, or at least play some Mario Kart. Which I will! Yeah, we go old school with the Mario Kart. Rush. So Rush is a movie directed by Ron Howard about a rivalry in Formula One racing between two drivers named Nicky Lauda and James Hunt. You know me, I love a good rivalry, Ron Howard's a good director, should be a good movie. Turns out, it was a good movie. I really like the rivalry between these two guys, but they're so contrasted, they're so different. James Hunt is just one of those, you live it up, you know, he's here for the fun of it. Tomorrow you might die, and he's completely willing to die, so it's like, hey, have fun. He's the id, he is the walking id. Then you have the Austrian Nicky Lauda, he's like, no, you gotta think smart, take emotion out of it, see it all as math, it makes you a safe driver, it makes you a better driver, and I will beat you. These two are like the Mozart and Salieri of the racetrack. Although Mozart was better than Salieri and these two are pretty evenly matched in their own ways and their own passions It's just a movie about two guys who want to be great They want to leave their mark on the earth and in doing so life will give them that little bonus of beating the other guy You would almost think hey these two would probably have a good time going out and getting a beer together Just shooting the shit fact is that's not gonna happen because just the sight of the other's face Infuriates them another thing this movie does well is these two are even in your mind's eye Neither one is the villain just two guys two different perspectives two different ways of going about one goal. So in that, sometimes you're like, ah, oh, James Hunt, he's got it right. You know, like, screw that Nikki Lauder guy. James Hunt's the man. And other times, you're like, Nikki Lauda is a badass. You know, James Hunt, you're not as cool as Nikki Lauda. He's pretty awesome. I, yeah, you don't understand. You just don't understand. When a movie can make me flip-flop like that and make me feel like I don't have conviction in my own opinion, that's not a bad thing. Props to that movie. And of course, the racing is intense and badass too. The revving up the cars, you see the pistons all like It's all slow-mo and shit. And you're like, yes. It has gotten real now. It's not much I didn't like about the movie. It's funny because I'm not a Formula One guy. It's not like I sit down on the most boring ass day of the week, Sunday, turn on racing and be like, oh, thank God, something good is on today. Not how I am. I'm like, oh, that's boring. Are there wipeouts happening? No wipeouts. I, I'm out. But this movie makes me care about Formula One racing. I want to Google it. I want to find out all about the sport. I guess what I'm trying to convey is you don't have to be a race car kind of guy to enjoy this movie. Any more than you need to be an MMA guy to enjoy the movie Warrior. It's not about the sport. The sport is a means to tell a story. And the story is told really well. These two characters are awesome. The rivalry was badass. I thought they were great. I walked out of Rush with nothing but satisfaction because Rush is... Awesome-tacular. <laughs> Rush is just, it's a sexy movie, if I could say it like that. I don't know if it was all the attractive ass people on screen, or the affection, or the hot chicks, or Olivia Wilde, just the speed, the rivalry, the tension. For some odd reason, I was just watching this movie with half a stack the entire time, and I was like, this its not a bad day for me. And if you're thinking to yourself, that doesn't make any sense, that guy on YouTube's a dipshit. You're gonna be watching Rush, and you're gonna think to yourself, yeah, this is one sexy ass movie. There's something about it. I'm just saying it's there. So Rush, have you seen it? What did you think about it? And what's your favorite racing movie out there? Think hard on that one. There's more than Fast and the Furious. There is more than what is just fast and what is just furious. And so whatever it would be, comment below, let me know. And as always, if you like what you've seen here and you want to see more, click right here to see more.